Greed is good, baby. At least that's what they say about this character. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if I, I can necessarily agree. I think I can. I've definitely not just been spending like the past, I don't know, probably hour and a half trying to get some nice runs going. To be fair, I've been playing the hard characters in the game. You know, this guy lost. I even tried some Tainted Lost earlier and, you know, uh, that wasn't going all that well. I just feel like doing uh, doing some tough runs today. Maybe trying to actually play some characters that aren't just trivial. Potentially, anyway. Potentially. Even even though I got out of bed mere hours ago, it might make sense to try and do something that gets me up in the morning. You know, gets me woken up. Let's see what we can do here, though. Oh, boy. Great start. Get hit immediately trying to chase some money. Wouldn't be Tana Keeper if that wasn't what you were doing. Tana Keeper really is like a character that you can play to, like, really practice your movement in this game, I feel. There's no other character where you have to have, like, as precise, insane movement. It's almost like I'm playing damn, like, vampire survivors, you know? Trying to squeeze between enemies, trying to get a coin. That's essentially what I'm playing at this point with this character. Don't tell me it ain't so! Just gonna squeeze right by you. Show me the shot before I go to the boss. Just because I wanna make sure I can get the most out of it. What if the shop has something crazy in it, right? Ooh, it does have mystery gift, which I will buy, uh, and then look for my secret room. Okay, okay, I was right in my guesses. Uh, that's just another item, an orphan socks. Interesting. Oh! <laughs> okay, okay, sure. I guess, you know what, I'll actually grab orphan socks. I disrespect this item sometimes, but it's actually, like, decent. No more spikes to worry about, plus the movement speed is actually good on keeper. It's actually nice. I guess we're having the glitch crown run, huh? Glitch crown instantly on the first floor. I didn't even have to work for it. You can't possibly say that I tried to make anything happen here on purpose. The game's just giving it to me. The game is just giving it to me. What can I do? Speedball's nice. Um, was there a key for sale in the shop? I will buy it if there is. Oh, no, 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 no. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. What am I doing? With Glitch Crown, you don't want to go old puff. With Glitch Crown, you don't want to go old puff. So I'm not going old puff. Because the um, the mystery item on each room is just going to cycle through. And then, you know, you end up missing out on extra items. And you don't even know what they are. So I'd rather just uh, not. Holy crap, look at his movement. All that Vampire Survivor is really coming in handy. That being said, I haven't played that game in a while. Should really play that more. It's, it's a fun game. Just haven't gotten around to it. This movement speed is nuts. I love it. 1.6 speed on the first floor is, is wonderful to have. And my luck is already scaling as well. This run has absurd potential. That that glitch crown pickup is hilarious. What do you got in here for me? Okay, there's a lot going on. There's there's a there's a lot going on in here. I want the school bag. I want which one of these do I want? Probably black candle, but now, Black Candle is definitely the best pickup here. You know how everybody always complains about golden pennies on big rooms? How about the golden penny on a small room? Now, that's... That's beauty right there. God, the movement speed is so... Like, you never really learn to appreciate movement speed until you, like, really, like, have a good use for it. But, man, it's so good on this floor. Look at that. I would have never gotten these coins without the speed. Let's peep this boss fight. Why not? That's just a big Larry. It's not even Larry Jr. anymore. This boy is literally as large as they get. This boy is Larry Sr. the wazoo, man. That doesn't make any sense. He's Larry Sr. the hell up. Do I want to peep that devil deal? Sure, first of all, let me take... Yeah, I'm going to take Coat Hanger here. I'll peep the devil deal. Why not? There could be some crazy stuff in here and... Well, there kind of is. There's a lot of good stuff. I kind of want to take money equals power. It's busted on this guy, right? Even though it means by passing up Succubus, which is obviously unfortunate. But money equals power is so good on Tana Keeper. And then, considering I've already committed to Devil Deals, I might as well take the mark, I guess? No, wait! Sanguine Bond. Yeah, Sanguine Bond, of course. It's, like, insanely busted. I don't want to mess this up. Sanguine Bond is so good on Tana Keeper. Because you can just play this if you get money. If you don't, well, no big deal, right? Sanguine Bond is basically just a... Just a damn, like, Devil Deal on steroid. Not a Devil Deal, a... a Sack room on steroids. Okay, well. Oh, okay, it closed now. Unfortunate. I have 30 cents. Would I rather spend them on the shop or would I rather spend them on the item room? On this, it would be jumper caves, but I don't even have an active yet. And on this, the best thing to take here is obviously going to be school bag, right? It's got to be school bag. As much as it pains me, it has to be that. I might as well peep the item room, right? 
I got 15 cents. Sure. There's a Dr. Fetus in there. <laughs> I'm not buying that. I'm getting piggy bank, if anything. Which is... Ironically... Okay, it's right before Dr. Fetus, so if I mess it up, that would be bad. Okay, no, I got it. If there's a thing to spend money on, it's definitely piggy bank. Piggy bank is gonna come in quite handy on this run. Alright. This run's, this run's looking pretty already, man. It's got a lot of stuff going for it right now. That Sanguine Bond is going to be nuts if it works out for me. Especially with Piggy Bank as well. It's only going to get better. It only gets better from here. Every room I clear, I literally become more powerful with the money I pick up. Not to mention I have Glitched Crown. Like, Jesus, dude. If I get Goat Head as well now, that just like Devil Deals stay open and I get one every floor. Holy shit, dude. There's my item room. Of course I'm checking it. Eh, there's nothing crazy in there. There's my shop, though. That's what I really want to see. <laughs> we got some stuff here. Uh, obviously, Keeper's Sack. Naturally. Which is after Sharp Plug? Or is Sharp Plug after it? No, it's after Sack Boy. Okay. Obviously, Keeper's Sack is a no-brainer take. Um, I probably want the Stopwatch, which is after Jar. And then I probably want to take either Mom's Purse or the Champion Belt, but I'll figure that out when the time comes. Keeper's Sack is also going to be so good here. Jesus Christ, man. They're giving me like all of the god items right now for Tainer Keeper. All right, let's do the boss. I don't have a lot of money, so, you know, the Devil Deal will be potentially not great for me. Uh, however, there is Sanguine Bond and I do have Piggy Bank, so the options are there. I got to watch out here. At least that money's permanent. How am I dodging this shit, brother? I should not be... Jesus. I should not be dodging as well as I was there. That was crazy. Oh my god. There's Twisted Pear! I just got an item? Okay. Uh, what do I want, though? I probably want Spirit of the Night, right? Okay, Multidimensional Baby works as well. Uh, please stay open. It did stay open. That's huge. I'm... Even though I'm doing this mostly for healing... I need to collect as much of this golden penny as I can and pray to God that it gives me enough money to buy. Like, just gotta pray that this is like the world's best golden penny I, you've ever seen. If I can get Twisted Pear here, holy shit, dude. Okay, well. Uh, it's not over yet, though. I still got this room, too. What? It closed! No! Okay, well, I guess we're taking bar of soap or something. There you go. Ah, oh, man. That, that pains me. Passing that up. Yeah, can't make that mistake again. Gotta have enough money when heading into the, um, into the devil deal. That being said, I guess I'll buy something here. I guess I'll get the, uh, I guess I'll get the champion belt. Yeah. Although, I don't really need damage that much, because I have keeper sack. I'll get a ton of damage anyway, so let's go for, let's go for the, um, purse instead. There you go. I need, like, a swallowed penny as well. That, that way the sanguine bond is really gonna pop off. Once I have that as well, I will become unstoppable. That's the spoon bender. Uh, sure. <laughs> there you go. That's, uh, amazing. Yes, I will gladly take that. <laughs> what a run it's been so far. That's a, that's a damn dime right there as well. Of course I'm peeping this. That's a lot of good stuff. I probably want Dead Onion, because you never know. God, the golden pennies as well. The game wants me to succeed. It, it knows what I'm trying to do, and it wants me to be successful. Oh boy, uh, there's, a, there's a lot to take in here. Uh, I will come back to that in a second, because I feel like the boss is coming up soon. I'd rather have some money ready for that, right? And then I'll worry about... Jesus Christ, you see... Oh my god, I messed it up so royally. Out of three nickels, I managed to pick up one. Alright, let's do this. Big horn. Brother, you are, you are getting shredded. The homing, piercing shots... You are- you stand no chance. Another golden penny. Jesus Christ. Okay, let's, uh, let's peep this. There's some good stuff in here. Um, I actually might want to buy Little Horn instead of Sin Robes. It, it's probably the best choice here. And then I guess maybe Ocular Rift? Yeah, it's probably Ocular Rift. There you go. And then we'll play this. Get a penny out of it. That's cool. Get another penny out of it. Okay, it stopped paying out. That's how it be sometimes. Probably damage. Plus, uh, you know, I already have a syringe, I think. So yeah, taking the second one is a good idea. All right, now we can worry about this shop. <laughs> now let me, let me, let me see, let me peep this shop. See what we got going on in here, right? We'll grab that first, and then I see a diplo in there as well. I know there's a lot of stuff in there. Okay. Oh, there's a sack room here too. Oh man, I can't grab any of this damn money. That's a bummer. If only I could grab any of that damn money if I had like some form of flight. That's actually, like, messed up. <laughs> it's actually kind of messed up. 
If only I had flight, this would be so much better. <clears throat> I guess I could have had it. I messed up grabbing Spirit of the Night, right? I did mess that up, so it's all on me for that one. God damn it. A sack room? Okay, let's leave money that's permanent on the ground and try to play that sack room. I wouldn't mind getting the key pieces. That would be kind of huge. The fool? You know what? This counts, actually. <laughs> this counts. This will work just fine. Because I can just drop it all on the floor in here and then we're good. There you go. You even gave me a coin back right away. Thank you, piggy bank. It hurts having to pick up the dimes for it, but what can you do, right? Okay, I, I, my brain short-circuited. I don't know why I was dancing. I don't even know what was on that pedestal, but I picked up Crown of Light by accident, and I am actually not complaining. <laughs> that could have gone a lot worse or a lot better. Crown of Light is going to be huge. Okay, okay. I, my brain was like, ah, I gotta get out of here. And then I just grabbed the item, and I just happened to get lucky and get Crown of Light, I guess. That's, that's cool. Acid Baby for Conjoined? That's like the most reasonable take here. Is Acid Baby for Conjoined. Please don't die fighting this angel now. That would be hilarious, but also bad. That would be so bad. Flies, do your job. Okay, got the, got the key piece. We're good, we're good. We're good, okay. Now we're talking. I don't think anything can stop me at this point. Like the only thing that can stop me is myself. Don't forget, you are always your own greatest enemy, but yeah, like, you know, oh boy. You're done. Another devil deal to spend all of my hard-earned cash on. There is an Incubus in there. Incubus is after Dwell. No, after after Death's Touch. Okay, Incubus is huge. That gives me Conjoined. Do I want Knife? Not really. Uh, I guess I'll take Rotten Baby. <clears throat> and then we'll play Sanguine Bond a little bit. That was risky. That was extremely risky. The Coins payout is really the one you want from this. You're giving me the damage, which is fine. I can live with that. One more, one more. Okay, got the Conjoined, got the Incubus. Oh my lord, dude. Oh, I love this run, buddy. It is... I got a smile on my face. This is the run I've been hoping for all damn day. Let's go. Let's go, dude. That's a Wafer and a Scifly. Wafer doesn't do anything for me, but Scifly sure does. Scifly is uh, sure as hell one of the most defensive items in the game. Yeah, I'll take that. That's just a crawl space. Okay, uh... It's a black market? <laughs> Hold on. Hold the phone. There's a lot of stuff in here that I like. There's a broken modem. There's a, there's a restock. There's another opportunity to smelter. Obviously, there's a steam cell, which I should have gotten first. Yes, I know. What can you do? There's deep pockets as well. These items are all great. These are all crazy good. And uh, I mean, I might as well just buy this for like the stats at this point. What do I want out of this? I don't even have an active item yet, so I might just take Mr. Me, I guess. There you go. Holy crap. <laughs> That was uh, quite the black market. Oh, I should leave this money on the floor. Speaking of markets, there's fucking birthright. Okay. I probably want to take there's options. That's jar of flies. That's not what I wanted to take. Oh, well. Give me x-ray. Uh, I see the soy milk, by the way. Don't worry about that. Uh, there's also chaos, which I kind of do want to take. Okay. There's almond milk, too. Are you kidding me? <laughs> do they even stack? Do almond and soy milk even stack? I feel like they don't. Before we move on with anything in that shop... I need more money. That's the main thing. I need more money. Where did you just see all those dimes? Where the hell did they come from? What was that? What the- was that, uh, that must have been like broken modem plus deep pockets. Jesus Christ. Yeah, okay, I'll go to the library. Sure. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god, bro. Are you seeing this? There's a god head, there's a cricket's head. That. Okay. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll take Backstabber. Although Red Key is fun. Well, I might take Red Key, actually. There you go. I don't need Jar of Flies. Uh, this is getting out of control very quickly. Oh my god, it's the secret room as well. I actually found it. I mean, this doesn't really matter because, you know, I got Chaos. But, like, I guess I'll just grab a random item. It's Guppy's Tail, sure. Uh, I, I don't know what's happening anymore, man. It's... Going kind of nuts. I definitely think I should take soy milk now. There you go. Um. <laughs> oh my god. I wish I had rock bottom, but you know. I guess I'll take rosary. Uh, that's hemolacria? Okay. There's also Jupiter. Who cares? It's after Jupiter, though. This is gonna go very crazy very quickly. That's for sure. Um... Uh, yeah, this... 
<laughs> Jesus Christ, man. It's gone kind of off the rails, huh? I, I think I'm done with this floor now. I think I can go fight the boss. Um, so let's just like... Yeah. Okay, didn't get, a, didn't get a deal. No big deal. Let's go up for once. Let's go up for once. I got Chaos anyway, so... Chaos Glitch Crown is, uh, is a spicy one, man. God, my game is actually lagging. I, it's, I, my game is gonna crash, I feel. I forgot I have money, money equals power as well. This, this is crazy, bro. Okay, uh, sure. Give me, give me sulfur, I guess. What the hell is even going on? I'm scared of even shooting just once, man. Another health up. 2020? Huh? Okay, I just randomly opened that chest. Sure, go off, I guess. Why not at this point, right? What do we have in here? Krampus? I love Sanguine Bond with Krampus, it's very funny. I actually want to take Lump of Coal, I think, which is... There you go, Lump of Coal. I'm, I'm still gonna find a way to throw this run, I'm telling you. Better be careful here. My game! It's very laggy. My poor, poor game. You know, it is kind of crazy how my damage multiplier is like a 0.4, and yet my damage is 18. Can you just imagine if I hadn't taken soy milk what it would be? It'd be crazy, man. It would be nuts. Whatever, let's just fight mom. It's not like it's big, but much of a challenge, really. Nah, I'm not even gonna play Sanguine Bond at this point. I'm just, I'm just done. Get me out of here. This run is crazy enough as is. I'm just gonna end it. I'm just gonna end the run. And I haven't even used Sulfur once. Once I start using that, I get like the Brimstone Beams as well, which probably will crash my game, to be fair. I guess I could check if I'm already at the point where my game is crashable, right? <laughs> Let's uh, give it a try. Nope, not yet. Not quite, but it may get there. The entire room is carpeted in like tears and damage auras and, and like what? What can you do if you're an enemy here? If you're my enemy, what can you do? These ghosts should have just stayed in the pots, man. They shouldn't have come out. They should have stayed in there. They really thought they were doing something. Nah, man. They should have just stayed in those damn pots. Oh my god, Swallowed Penny as well. It should have shown up way sooner, but now I'm probably unkillable. Now I've probably attained, like, invulnerability status. Let's see what we got here. I'll do one item at a time, otherwise I'm gonna go insane. But I will take Blood of the Mortar. I, I will take Blood Clot. Meat? Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay, just a little laggy. Okay, I guess I got Stapler. Should have probably washed out, but I didn't get my frame rate dipping, doesn't help. <laughs> Uh, there's an apple in there. There's a little dumpy in there. Any stray tear can still like easily kill me at this point. So I'd rather have the defense to withstand something like that from happening. Uh, that's what the fuck, bruh! I'm taking spin down. Obviously, what the hell? Red key. Red key becomes spirit sword. I can't. I can't take spirit sword. That's anti synergy. You know what? I guess we'll leave behind red key. Okay, yeah, sure, spin down dice as well, right? Just add that to the pile at this point. Just add it to the pile of absolutely insane items. I think I should... Look, Trisagin is great. I think I should take Shielded Tears, because that way nothing can ever harm me ever again. Oh, lovely. You love to see the secret room with the two chests in it. Ah, that's a quad shot. That's a Polythemus! <laughs> oh my god, bro. I mean, yeah, it's also Sacred Orb, but come on, it's Poly. Okay, and then... I don't know, do I want quad shot? Yeah, I probably want quad shot. Although fires would be fun as well. There you go. Jesus Christ, brother. I don't eat. I'm not gonna try to describe what is happening on the screen. If you're a blind viewer, uh, you know, the audio description will not be able. You will not be able to imagine what is even going on. If you're epileptic, I probably should have had that warning uh, approximately 10 minutes ago. Uh, but I'm sure that you know you shouldn't be watching this anymore if it goes poorly. Uh, that's wait. That's a fucking. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. That's a. That's a damn. Sacred Heart in there. After Clear Rune. Yeah, that's Sacred Heart right there, baby. Okay. Add that to the pile. <laughs> Might as well use the World Card, right? There you go, get a, get a Crawl Space. What do you got down here? Oh, there's Bird's Eye again. There's Pluto as well. And a Reroll Machine. You know what? Proptosis wants to show up again. Nah. I should look what they spin down into as well, to be fair. I should look what they spin down into, although I don't have a charge right now. That's an Immaculate Heart, which is just like a crazy item to take, probably. Just a bunch of bombs. Obviously, there's an R key in there, but I'm not gonna go for the R key. I'll just take Immaculate Heart, I think. Okay, Tech Point 5 is also fine. I messed it up a little bit. No matter. It doesn't really matter. <laughs> I mean, nothing can stop me at this point. There's a Mega Mush. It really wants me to go with the R key, huh? 
Okay, hold on. If I can get Rock Bot. Whoops. If I can get Rock Bottom, I'll be very happy. I'll probably take Pyromaniac here. At this point, I kind of got to see if I can get it somehow. I mean, Chaos and all that. Cricket's Body, Triple Shot. That's forget me now. I didn't mean to take that. Oh, well. Hold on. Hold on. Uh, Botfly spins down into Death Certificate, right? Okay, well, here's what we do then. We know the plan now. We become Proptosis again. Proptosis just doesn't want to stop showing up, huh? We get a charge. We get Death Certificate. Get Funny Rock, unless it wants to show up beforehand. Okay, we spin down the Botfly, which is after Squeezy, I think. Yeah, okay. Okay, now I just gotta not mess up picking up Death Certificate, which is after breakfast. Okay, so here's the plan. We find Rock Bottom. Oh, another item for me. Oh, a C-section for me? Oh, you shouldn't have. <laughs> oh, you really shouldn't have, game. Just a C-section for free for me? Nope. But we're getting there. We're getting there. There it is. There it is. Okay. Rock bottom. I'll use the Mega Mush right at the end to see how much damage I can get out of it. What is going on, bro? I can't see anything on the screen. <laughs> It's just all bright lights. What is happening? I don't know what the items in there are. I need to, like, leave the room. Oh, rubber cement, sure. At this point, why not, right? Nah, damn, that's mom's pet. Okay, well, whatever, bro. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I guess there's a chest that dropped somewhere. There it is. Oh, my God. I could have had rock bottom this way, too. Maybe at this point I take... Wait, what? I can have a second polyphemus for the flex. That's kind of funny. Sure, why not? At this point, why not, right? Two polys? I don't think they even stack. Another polyphemus. Yeah, it does nothing. Who would have thought? Okay, uh... Well, that's a lot of damage. A little bit more damage, huh? Might as well eke a little bit more damage out of this with money equals power. <laughs> Might as well. Not even a doubt in my mind. I don't even know what's going on. There's just like... A yellow aura is covering my screen. My screen is just covered in piss. I don't know what's happening. But Mega Satan is dying. I guess. I guess he's dead. Okay. Sure. Did you see anything happen? I certainly didn't. I, I certainly didn't. Alright, he's dead. No void, huh? You know what? It might be for the better. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, that might have been the best run I've ever had. Holy crap.